Other news tonight, this morning, the Rapid City firefighters were called to the scene to extinguish a cooking fire in a local Rapid City neighborhood. The fire started when the stove was left unattended. The food then burned and then caught on fire. It is the 38th cooking fire in the Rapid City area since September 1st. And with the holiday season being the most active time for kitchen fires and for garage fires as well, Rapid City Fire Department is encouraging people to take extra precaution when cooking this holiday season. You know, holiday season we've seen an increase in a few things. Um, we like to show, we like to demonstrate and show, you know, safe cooking practices because there's going to be a lot more families in town, a lot more people cooking larger meals for larger gatherings. Yeah. So we will see an increase in cooking related incidents. So last year alone, just over Thanksgiving holiday, so just that couple days, that's Thanksgiving holiday, we had nine related uh, of fires, and a handful of those were basically because of cooking and unattended cooking. And Kaylin Meningas says there are several things that you can do to prevent cooking fires, such as setting a cooking timer and having a pot holder and lid on hand. On Monday, November 25th, the Rapid City Fire Department will conduct live fire cooking demonstrations. They're going to demonstrate how you can better prepare to be safe with you and your family this holiday season.